Man, my game is running so slow. I wish there was a way I could fix it. Hey, you. Wait, who said that? It's your imagination. Uh, yeah? There is a way you can fix it. Wait, there is? Yes, it's called Optifine. Oh, that's cool. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another video. My name is Zinder. In today's video, I will be showing you how to install and play Optifine for Minecraft for free. And don't worry, it's all safe. I will also be showing you near the end of the video how to install shaders as well. So let's hop right into it. Oh, and don't forget to leave a like. So what exactly is Optifine? Well, this is the Optifine official website. I'll have it linked in the description. Optifine is a Minecraft optimization mod. It allows Minecraft to run faster and look better with full support for HD textures and many configuration options. Things like FPS boost, dynamic lighting, better grass, snow, clear water, natural textures, a lot of great enhancements that I really love. I play Optifine with Minecraft all the time. Optifine is a 100% safe mod to download. There will be no viruses or anything. So, how, how exactly do you download Optifine? Well, let's first go to the downloads page. Then check this out. We have a few different options. We have the latest release of Minecraft, which is Minecraft 1.16.5. Then we have the full release for that Optifine version. But, check this out. We also have a preview versions button. We click it and we get to preview the latest version. Next, what you want to do is do not click the download button, but click the mirror button. The download button will take you to an ad and then it'll be all kind of confusing. Click the mirror button and it'll take you directly to the download. So for me, I'm going to be downloading the preview version. So we clicked mirror and then we have this that popped up. Preview Optifine 1.16.5, preview 4. So then you want to click download and then you'll notice it'll go down here and an ad will come up. It'll tell you that this file can harm your computer but it really doesn't so press keep now what we want to do is locate where the file actually went so it went into my downloads folder so now what we want to do is take it and drag it onto our desktop and if for whatever reason it doesn't have this like coffee cup logo we'll talk about that in a second but for now what you want to do is double click on it then this will pop up and it'll say install but if this doesn't pop up we'll also talk about that in a second it means you don't have java but if it does in the meantime, let's just click install, and boom, that's literally it. Now we can open up our Minecraft launcher and click play. So that's that's really it for Optifine. Now, let's say that this coffee cup doesn't appear and this menu doesn't appear. Well, there's a way you can actually fix that. If the Java logo doesn't appear, you're going to have to install Java. This is Minecraft Java for mods and servers. I'll have this also in the description. You want to click download and it'll basically just, you know, it'll download and then you won't have to worry about it anymore. But let's say that doesn't work. For me, this is the case. It hasn't worked still. Well, if this doesn't work still, then you want to download Jarfix. I'll also have this in the description. You want to download Jarfix to repair .jar files on your PC. Download it and you won't have to worry about it ever again. I had an issue where it wouldn't work for me, so I had to download Java and Jarfix. But after that, my PC is still safe and it works perfectly. And so that's Optifine. We now have Optifine installed on our computer and we can go to options, video settings, and check out all the uh, the shaders and the details. Yep, we definitely have Optifine. It even says Optifine down here. But let's say you want some shaders. Shaders are really beautiful. So I'm gonna show you how to install shaders. Let's go. This is my favorite shader pack by far. BSL shaders, oh, it's, it's so beautiful. Just look at this picture. They're beautiful, and I kind of want to play it with these. So, how are we going to download them? Well, whatever, no matter what shaders you want, try to locate the download um, button. You know, try to download them. So, we are on the download page right now, and then we have download, and then, check this out. We have Preview 2. The, the version of BSL shaders that I ran last was Preview 1, so they've actually updated it since. You can see here on the 4th of January. So, let's go ahead and tap download. And then you'll be brought to this page. It'll kind of do a little countdown. And then boom, we have a .zip folder. Now we want to run a specific command. So on your computer, hold Windows and R, and then this will pop up. This is a run screen. And you want to type this into it, press OK, and boom. Now we have this menu. Now what we want to do is we want to open up shader packs right here and check this out. It's empty. So we're going to want to locate where we downloaded the BSL shaders or whatever shader pack you want. And for me, that would be in this PC and downloads. Then we want to take this, drag it into here, unzip it, and let's see. Do we have the shader pack? Uh, yes, we have the shader pack. 
Now we can run shaders on Minecraft. Let's go ahead and load this bad boy up. Oh yeah, shaders, BSL shaders. I'll have a link to them in the description as well. They look so beautiful. That's going to do for today's quick tutorial video. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you found this useful. If you want more tutorials, then subscribe and tap the notification bell. That's going to do it for me today. If you have any problems or questions, let me know in the comments. See you in the next one. Goodbye.